Hello, this is the Patia News. I'm Adam, and here are today's headlines. The Patia area was hit by several hours of heavy uh, thunderstorms this morning, which began around 10.30 to 11 o'clock and lasted until almost 2, 2.30 in the afternoon today. It's the largest amount of thunderstorms that the area has had in several months and tested a lot of the new systems that are in place in the city. As many are aware, the city is currently under construction in multiple areas, including Beach Road, Sagbuakau, and the second road area, installing much larger drainage uh, to alleviate flooding. Of course, the project is not done yet. It's estimated to be finished in February of 2020, which continue to rile local residents as traffic in town has become very difficult in many areas due to the amount of construction. Because of the construction, the amount of pits, and the fact that the flooding and drainage network project is not yet complete, the city did predictably go ahead and flood today. Uh, several areas were very, very bad, especially near the uh, bottom of Pradamak Hill, which has been an issue for quite a while near Soy 16 and Walking Street. Although there's extensive work being done, which should have that area fixed, at this time, it was still a big deterrent today where several vehicles, including uh, which we posted on our Facebook, a bot bus got trapped in the water for a period of time. Soy Kao Noi, Soy Taloi, the dark side, and several other areas also uh, became inundated with water today and nearly impassable at times. There is more water and, and rain in the forecast in the next several days, according to the Thai Meteorological Department. As always, stay tuned to the Patia News for the latest and greatest in local, regional, and national news.